Hi, welcome to The Soap Scoop. Look away now if you don't want to peek at the week's unmissable soap storylines. I'm Toby Earl. Unsurprisingly, Ronnie's gone a bit spare after the demise of Danielle. But the blonde bomber is back up to fighting weight and he's back in the ring this week. Jack's her opponent and baby Amy's being used to the metaphorical punch bag. That's metaphorical punch bag, not a real one. Just so we're clear. Anyway, Jack has asked Roxy to see Amy. But she says that's difficult, what with Ronnie being so fragile. So he files for custody of Amy. Ronnie's furious and brutal. She tells him he was just the sperm donor and she and Roxy will raise the baby. Later, Jack tries to be civil, says he only wants to do what's right for Amy. But when Ronnie starts to organise the christening, Jack decides that he wants to make him, Amy and Roxy a proper family. But where's that going to leave Ronnie? And have his feelings for her really died? Masood, meanwhile, is worried that Zainab's mysterious behaviour means she's spicing up her life. Oh, how wrong can he be? There is a mystery man, but he's not a lover. Maria and Tony are growing ever closer in Corrie. Eh? And Luke clumsily helps them on their way. He knows Tony's got a private eye tailing him, and he decides to retaliate by hiding in the factory wearing a Tony mask. As you would. But the prank goes wrong, as he ends up terrifying Maria instead. There's a ruck, and Luke fires Tony, though he's not rich enough to go on his own. A little fact that Tony's well aware of. Maria, meanwhile, is frightened about going for her scan, so Tony offers to go with her. The pair share an intimate moment when Maria learns she's having a boy, but Tony's conscience kicks in and he freaks out. Later, Tony puts Tom off Maria's scent by offering to buy a share of lad rags, and Luke agrees to make all decisions on Underworld jointly when he realises Tony has him over a barrel. It's all falling into place for the laughing Scotsman. <laughs> Loretta the lap dancer decides to share her skills in Hollyoaks this week. In between clubs, she finds herself homeless, much to Dom's happiness. But just as he's about to ask her to move in, Darren gazumps him and tells her he has a spare room. Does it have an ensuite pole? Dom's misery grows when Loretta decides to teach Cindy some moves and says she'll get her an audition. This gives Cindy big ideas and she tells Tony what he can do with his job. After the audition, the girls are followed home by a mystery figure, who soon turns out to be Dom. She confronts his weirdo behaviour, but he plays her like a fiddle when he reveals his paranoia after Niall killed Tina. She again agrees to quit dancing for him, but she can't keep away from that pole. Darren, meanwhile, is enjoying having her around too. It's goodbye Daz in Emmerdale. The lad's driven to the drastic departure by Victoria's revelation that she's not pregnant. She just said it to get more of his attention. But that cunning plan creates more havoc in the Dales as Victoria goes back to bad boy Aaron and, after Andy intervenes, she decides to take things even further with him. When Andy learns the truth about Victoria and Daz, he throws him off the farm and with that, Au revoir, Dazzler. And that's all of our revelations for this week. Come back again next Friday for more from the nation's favourite shows, only at whatsontv.co.uk. Keep clicking. <laughs> <laughs>